believe the confessor is wrapping up his sermon. You should head inside. They are doomed, brothers and sisters, and they know it. The people of Far Harbor need only peer out their windows to look upon the face of Adam himself. Given form and holy form. Yet no matter how inevitable Adam's reign in this land may be, they deny it. Scoff at us behind their condensers. Kill our missionaries. Slay those who only wish to bring them no longer. After years of skulking in the shadows like whipped dogs, our purpose is clear. And I know the key to our victory lies within the nucleus itself. We will claim the secrets hidden away by that accursed robot. And with them, we will wipe Far Harbor from the island. Adam's veil will roll down its streets. Holy fog cleansing the land of their heresy. And when we are finally granted division, it will be as heroes. A new day dawns, brothers and sisters. Glory to Atom! Glory to Atom! Ah, I've heard whispers of a new convent. Welcome. How does it feel to take your place among Adam's Chosen? Adam's Chosen? This place, the Nucleus, the island, Adam has claimed it all. For us, he's chosen all but one blasted corner. You've been to Far Harbor, yes? Seen its barriers against Adam's holy fog? Its citizen's blasphemous refusal to vacate what is clearly his domain. What would you do with such a place? Is Far Harbor really that bad? Yes, brother, they are. For years, my predecessor begged for peace, while Far Harbor fortified their bastion of heresy. We tried to help them, to bring them Adam's light. Many of our brethren ended up dying. For but now that I am High Confessor, that time is over. All Adam's foes, whether Far Harbor cowering behind their precious condensers, or that ancient robot hiding away his memories within our very home, they will come to recognize Adam as the sole master of this island. But it is only through unity that we can succeed. Adam requires devotion from all his children. Embrace that, and you will do well here. Now. Was there anything you required? Would you mind answering a couple questions? Certainly. What do you wish to know? What happened to the Confessor before you? Martin. No one knows. One night he was sleeping in his chambers in the vessel, and the next morning, He'd simply vanish. The other zealots and I organized a party to try and find him. To no avail. I wouldn't be shocked if he took up in Far Harbor or fled to the south. His dedication to Adam had become questionable. He'd done nothing when Far Harbor executed one of our missionaries. So I dare say it's best that he fled. What happened to this missionary? A foul atrocity. Our good brother Andrews had decided to brave the fog and attempt to bring Adam's light to that ghastly town and remind the heathens of their trespasses. From what I hear, he'd barely spoken a word before they cut him down in cold blood for nothing more than his devotion. Beasts. There's so much radiation on the island. How come people here don't Some do. But most of our family has been blessed at birth with an affinity for the glow. It's no more to us than a May rain. Warm. Comfort. It's why a place like this island truly is meant for his children. Others simply wither away while we gladly await division. 
tell me about the vision? Adam's greatest gift. Locked inside us all are billions of invisible worlds, waiting only to be touched by his glow in order to be born anew through division. During the Great War, it was granted to many, though they certainly didn't realize it. But today, it is often a slow process, taking years of exposure in order to be realized. We are all here to spend our lives seeking the promise of division, however long it may take. Now, did you have another question? I heard the children are responsible for the fog. Is of that course. true? The fog predates our arrival on the island, certainly. But before us, it was but an occasional presence. Yet through our faith, our devotion to family, Adam saw fit to reach across the land, claiming for us more, year after year, until near all lay beneath his grasp. Now, was there something else I could answer for you? How is it you came to this place? We were guided here many years ago, after our exile from Far Harbor. The first of us, my predecessor, Martin and I, had come north at the behest of Adam's great prophet, Confessor Cromwell, from a small refuge in the capital wastes. When we arrived on the island, we found a few souls receptive to Adam's message. Anna, the Archimist was formerly Far Harbor's doctor before she found the light. But most, they thought us a menace. We were chased from the town, driven into the wilds, barely escaped with our lives. Some of us were never the same. It was only thanks to the grace of Atom that we survived, and finally found a place that we could call home. Didn't have anything else for the moment. Adam, keep you. Oh, no. The body can repair tissue damage, but still, too much ah, radiation there you too are. quickly can cause have a job for you. What kind of job? A matter of heresy that needs to be dealt with. So long as it doesn't involve drinking from any more poison water features. No, not so much. There is a woman, one of our own. Or she was, but she's given Wind. herself over to something. The Dark. confessor ordered Zealot Field to track her down, but the heretic now Gwyneth has begun profaning our holy sites with her mad ravings, openly flouting the confessor the wants her found and executed. Why have me do this? You have other zealots who probably know the area. Consider better. it a test. Prove your dedication to the family. We can't try talking to her. Maybe she'll see reason. Well, I... Sister Gwyneth was a good woman. But whatever's driven her to this lunacy, I'm not sure how much it's left The High behind. Confessors decided her abandonment of Adam's too great a sin. The refusal of his grace can't be permitted. I'll find her, Granzo. Good. Speak to Zealot Thiel. She should be able to point you towards bringing Adam's trail. judgment to the heretic. Now go. dispensed Adam's judgment to Sister Gwyneth? Oh. Oh, please. Oh. Keep the faith. my child. Was there something you required? I found this icon. The Grand Zealot said you'd be interested in seeing... Is that the mother 
So the whispers were true. You saw the mother of the fog. Many of Adam's children spend their whole lives wishing for such a boon. It would seem he expects great things from you, child. As will I. Now, was there anything else? I'd like to help the family. Is there anything I can do? Eager. There is a member of our little community I've suspected for some time now. My own inquiries have proven fruitless. But your relative newness will likely make it easier for you to sniff out the truth. I would have you investigate this person. Should you find proof of any heresy or disloyalty, you are to bring it to me. So you can be trusted and you'll be rewarded. What exactly am I looking for? Hard evidence of any plots against myself, the family, or disrespect towards Holy Adam. Such transgressions cannot be allowed to stand. If there was nothing else... Child, is something wrong? What is it? Do you see something? What is it? Do you see something? Child, is something wrong? If there was nothing else... You mentioned a reward. There is a relic. A sacred cowl that I've been holding on to. Perform the deed to my satisfaction, and it's yours. Consider it done. Superb. Bring whatever you find directly to me. Here, the person in question. Leave no stone unturned. This is a chance to prove your value to Adam. 